even though the ground looks level, quite often there's just a little bit of space on one side of the ramp. So this is a concern for a couple of reasons. One of which is that, you know, the horse is like a firm surface to walk on. And the other reason is that if the ramp isn't supported on both bottom corners, it puts torque on the hinges every time the ramp is stepped on. So, we keep the wedge for the ramp hung up in the tack room of the trailer. And then we also have some boards that we use to cover the hinges on the ramp because there's a bit of a space in here that Rob will show you before I put the boards in just to illustrate what I'm talking about. See this wide gap here? That's ideal for a horse because we have reining horses and uh, they have slide plates on. When they're backing out, they could catch a slide plate on this and pull a shoe off. So we put the boards on there just for that little bit of protection. So the boards Rob have made and they just slide in. Just like so. Thereby, thereby covering up the hinges and that gap that was there. And then we'll take the wedge, put it under this side of the ramp, just to help stop that movement and torque on the ramp when we go to put the horses on the trailer. <laughs> 